Hello everyone and welcome to my channel, where we delve into the most intriguing and sometimes gruesome events in history. Today we're going to talk about the Sandby Berg Massacre. It's a little known event that took place in Sweden over 1,500 years ago. Despite the passage of time, the story still sends shivers down the spine. So, let's jump in and explore what happened. The Sandby Berg Massacre happened in the year 450 AD, during the late Roman Iron Age. Sandby Berg was a small village on the southeastern coast of Sweden, inhabited by around 15 families. It was a peaceful place, surrounded by a wooden palisade fence for protection against possible threats. In the year 450 AD, a group of unknown individuals attacked the village. The attackers were ruthless and showed no mercy. They killed everyone they came across, including women and children. The inhabitants of Sandby Berg were caught off guard, and the village was quickly overrun. It's unclear why the attackers targeted Sandby Berg. Some theories suggest that the attackers were looking for something specific, while others believe it was a random attack. Regardless, the massacre was brutal, and the village was left in ruins. After the attack, the village was abandoned, and the bodies were left to decay. It wasn't until the 20th century that the remains of Sandby Berg were discovered by archaeologists. The discovery shocked the world, and the story of the Sandby Berg massacre spread. The archaeologists who discovered the remains of Sandby Berg were able to gather a lot of information about the attack. They found evidence that the attackers had looted the village, as there were very few artifacts left behind. They also found evidence that the attackers had set fire to the village, burning it to the ground. Scientists have also discovered clues to the cause of the massacre. They found Iron Age tools and weapons at the site, some of which were broken and stained with blood. Some old maps and documents indicate that this area was suffering from permanent conflicts between tribes and ethnic groups at the time surrounding the massacre. Perhaps the most intriguing aspect of the Sandby Berg massacre is the fact that the attackers left the bodies of their victims where they lay. They didn't try to hide the evidence or bury the bodies. This suggests that the attackers had no fear of retribution and were confident that they wouldn't be caught. The reason for the attack is still not entirely clear, but scholars agree that the attackers were seeking to plunder and rob the village's precious riches and resources. In conclusion, the Sandby Berg Massacre is a grim reminder of the violence that has plagued humanity throughout history. The attack on Sandby Berg was brutal and senseless, and it left an entire village in ruins. Even though the event happened over 1,500 years ago, it still sends shivers down the spine. Thank you for joining me on this journey into the past, and I hope you found this video informative. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe for more content like this.